All right, you are Cox here. Uh, unfortunately, watching something kind of not my favorite. Uh, one f interesting character beating up another. <laughs> so yeah, thank you. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll keep going. We're we'll going. We're gonna keep going. The Iconics ring to you. Showing off Marco. A long time, months. He's ready. He's ready. As far as I can tell, he's pretty much ready. So I'm going to uh, show him off first, as we always do here. Show him off using Bandicam now. Watch. And then we're going to watch him beat the heck out of Kung Fu Man. And then I'm going to play as him in Through the Banker Gang. Try to beat that. Oh boy. Like this here. If we do that. Using the, yeah, Marco uses karate. I try to get a more uh, realistic style of karate for him. And, you know, that's how I do things. And I'm trying to do that. And different things like that. We have, like, some stuff going on here. We have his style here. His fan children, you know, his you know, star and their fan children. It's uh, of my personal, you know, fan children. And that's how that goes with these. Yeah, I, uh, my voice, of course, for his voice, but, you know, so I do it. You yeah, know, that's fine. I'm trying to make movie characters as, uh, well, inexpensively, mm, simply as possible, but still pretty awesome. <laughs> That was a good one. Oh, yes, I can move that over. I forgot about that. No. I can move his head, his, his the picture of his face over. I can do that. So I might do that. No. After this bat, after he wins here. No, yeah, he's most likely he's going to win. Because, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Kung Fu Man has some interesting uh, abilities, but, uh, yeah, my, my character's based off of Idol from Killer Instinct, a version of Idol from Killer Instinct for, made for Mugen, usually just to tear through him. Oh. Now, he, lately, there's been some interesting things. He, he Kung Fu Man has learned to block a bit, stuff like that, but it's no, no match. He's still no match for him. Mm. I wonder if he'll do it. I wonder if he'll do a culture combo. I don't know. It's not looking like it. Yeah. But we don't know until we try. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah. So he gives him that the um that attack is supposed to be like a punch to like the like the chest and groin or something like that. I don't know exactly how that works. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah, and it's, so it's like it's not deadly, but it does hurt a lot. So it's oh my god, <laughs> you know why not have it be something that's in karate? You know I've seen it, uh, and does hurt a lot. <laughs> Definitely <laughs> the idea of it. So yeah, there you go. Yeah, you know? he's a human being, so he's not gonna be like the most super powerful of all, but he can still do some, some damage. Definitely <laughs> with his with his, with his awesome skills. Skills. So that was those Marco, my, my version of Marco from Mugen. Um, I'm gonna continue working on making, continue to make things better for him, better for them, and everything like that. But yeah, it's, it's the things as he see turned out a lot better. He turned out pretty good, especially with the Geisha mom. Poor old Geisha mom. I probably will. I will work on her some more. I will make a new one eventually, but it's gonna take a while. I got a few other guys I want to make first. So I'll see you guys next time. Check me out on YouTube and if you aren't. And I'll stay tuned for the next one, next video of Marco beating up the Mega Game. Okay, I'll stop.